Brendan Jen, I just spoke to the assistant police chief a couple of minutes ago who says that the child's death is being investigated as a suspicious death. And what that means is that at this point, it is an ongoing investigation and they can't determine if that child died of a criminal aspect or of natural causes. But police are still on scene behind me. This is happening at 122 Davenport Avenue. Now, for reference, this is about a half a block away from Yale New Haven Hospital's emergency department. But first responders treated the child here at the home. They first were called here just afternoon for a report that a three-year-old boy was unresponsive. When firefighters and medical personnel arrived at the home, they found the child inside the home. They performed life-saving measures and worked on the child, but ultimately, again, the child was pronounced deceased at the home. Now, at this point, police say, again, it's still very early on in the investigation. They say the special victims unit is here and speaking to family members, and police did say that there were adults home at the time when the call first came in. Uh, investigators will be speaking with the family to try to determine how the child died, as well as an autopsy that will also help give them some answers. Now, at this point, police say that they are seeking a search warrant to go inside of the home, so they do expect to be on scene for a while. We're going to continue to follow this closely, and any new information that we get about what happened will pass along to you. Live in New Haven, Gabby Molina, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.